As I said, I, I never really got on with just in time. It really didn't signify what just in time was all about, which was continuous improvement and getting rid of waste. Lean, however, speaks to me. It's about doing more with less. In essence, that's what it's about. So, there are five principles of lean. Number one. Value must be viewed from the customer's point of view. So whatever you're doing in your organization, is the customer prepared to pay for it? Does it add value? Is the customer prepared to pay for that value? If it doesn't, then I need to find some way of eliminating it, or getting rid of it, or reducing it. And there are things today that we couldn't eliminate, say, 10 years ago. But because of process changes and technology changes, things that we identified as waste 10 years ago are still identified as waste, but we are now able to reduce them or get rid of them today. So label those waste. You may not be able to get rid of it today, but in the future, you may be able to. We've already identified it. We're keeping our eye on it. How can we reduce it? Can technology help us to eliminate it altogether? We need to identify and map the value stream. Get that book, Learning to See by John Shaw. Go out and map your processes. You will be horrified at the way you're currently running your business. You will identify opportunities for improvement, no problem. You can become a real hero in your business. Make value flow, ideally one piece at a time. So instead of making big batches, reduce your batch sizes. Get down to a batch size of one if you can. It's not going to be possible in some business, but that has to be our objective. Pull, only make when needed. So don't make something <coughs> until somebody says they want to. Perfection, producing only what is required, when required, at a fair price with minimum waste. So those are the five principles that we live by in lean.